G'day guys, Ollie here from Drift TV here at the skate pit mini ramp and we're going to be checking out a new surf skate today. We're going to be checking out the Smooth Star Felipe Toledo which is in this box right here. We've got the black edition number 77, high demand. Uh, they sell out within days as soon as they land in the UK so we managed to snag one. Then we're going to open it up and we're going to check it out. Let's have a look. So she's nicely bubble wrapped, so I'll just undo the bubble wrap and we'll check it out. She's a nice big 34 inches long, 10 inches wide, so we've got lots of deck space to keep those feet on. Boy, that is nice, look at that. That is a very nice board. So it's a nice, nice, oh that's nice, she's nicely She's a nice, 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 look at that. It's a very nice board. It's a nice, nice looking board. Looks very, very nice. Wow, 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 it's a very nice. So it's a nice, uh, quite a long 22 inch wheelbase. And it's a very look, nice looking board. So as I said, it's 34 inches long, 10 inches wide. It's got an excellent surf truck from the Smooth Star. It's one of the highest rating uh, surf skates out there. Everyone raves about them, so we're going to check it out. We're going to have a look, we'll do some close-ups, we'll get some skates in on it, and we'll put it all in and, and we'll let you know. But it looks very, very nice. It's a very nice. All right, guys, we're gonna have a look at the board now. So a few things we noticed that we didn't already know about is uh, the back wheels are slightly larger. So if you see on the wheel there, it says an L, slightly larger than the front wheels, which makes it a little bit easier to carve. The way it's set up just seems to work better. They've got big spaces, a uh, bigger one at the back. They've got the nice wheel arches, which will help. Uh, so far this, uh, on this board, we haven't had much wheel bite. Uh, on the Yao, we've had a few. So yeah, it's pretty good. The front truck is no springs like some of the other designs out there and that's real, spins nice big calves and big turns on that easy. It's got a real good rocker on top, like concave. Nice, nice big wide tail where you really get your foot on that. And it's actually got a nice kicked up tail, which the Yao pipe, which we previously reviewed, doesn't have as much. So it's nice, actually gets your foot in there a bit more. And it's a nice long 34 inch deck, so it's, Perfect, cruising around.
in summary guys we love it uh, it's a brilliant board it is the top of the range deck so it's 330 uh, coming into the UK 330 pounds um, definitely worth it though the Yao is brilliant as well and I think that comes in about 250 depending on which one you're getting so you do save a bit but I think for what you are getting it's a brilliant board we really love it it's great fun to skate can't really say much else about it but it's one of the best it's the best one we've tried out of the land yacht surf skate and the Yao uh, the Yao pipe we've tried it's definitely the one to go for if you're keen uh, to improve your surfing and just enjoy surf skate and cruising style. Um, get on it, check it out. Don't forget to check, check us out on Drift Life and our YouTube channel and our Instagram page as well, guys. Loads of giveaways and lots of stuff happening on that. So stay tuned and check it out. Cheers, guys. Yeah. Falls pretty quick. Oh my <laughs> <God>. <laughs> Did you?